I think one of the best values in the spring catalog is this pinwheel sizzlet. Now let me show you how just how easy it is to use. So once you've taken and run your cardstock or designer series paper through the Big Shot, you just want to remove the paper and there are five little holes that need to be punched out here. One in the center and one in each tip. So just use a piercing tool or something sharp and remove each of those circles. Now let me show you how I put these together. The first thing you want to know is whichever side you want to be the focus point of the pinwheel. So in this case we want the bigger circles up front. You're going to hold it the opposite way. So I'm going to have the smaller circles towards myself. I'm going to put the piercing tool in from underneath and then I'm just going to start with one corner and bring it down onto the piercing tool. and then just keep going with all of the corners. So one right after the other. So work your way around. And you can see now that those larger circles are becoming what we see primarily. Once you've done that, you're just gonna go ahead and pinch and remove the piercing tool. So now you've got the hole in the middle. You're holding it in place. Gonna put the brad in. Put open the back of the brads. And that's it. Your pinwheel is ready to go. Whether you use designer series paper or cardstock, it works exactly the same way. So again, these are lots of fun to make. The Sizzlet's die is only $5.95 in Canada. You can't go wrong with that. Happy stamping!